What's going down, Molly Skyler fans? I'm tired, but I'm getting up to do this because I feel like it has to be done. Sushi. <sighs> What's the biggest sushi roll you've ever seen in your life? Well, I had the decision to be going between a big log style or a very extremely long one. I went with the long one. <sighs> so, my buddy, my friend, Mr. Anthony Cavada at the Steak in Maine decided to make me this massive sushi roll. And they're making it for me this morning. And we tentatively went with 15 feet and 15 pounds. Oh, God. I'm not a huge sushi fan. I do like some sushi, but I have no idea what I'm walking into. So, <sighs> Molly Skyler, mom and woman versus food. I'm hopefully going to be cleaning my plate. Wasting food is rude, but oh my god, I'm scared. <sighs> I will see you in a few hours after I take this down. Okay, guys. So, my amazing friend, Anthony Cavada, from the steak in Maine, that guy right there. Would you like to get in the picture, Mr. Sir Man? No, I'm busy. He's busy right there being a jerk. So, he wanted to make basically one of the world's biggest sushi challenges, which he basically accomplished here. It's 15 pounds of fun. I am not a sushi eater, I admit that. Um, dang, this is 15 feet, 15 pounds. I don't even know if I can technically do this. This, is like, this goes all the way down this massive table. So, I really don't know if this is even doable. Um, I'm probably going to be gagging near the end, I, I will admit that. But, we're going to make this work. Because, because cats. Because we all love cats. Catherine. Hey. <laughs> I ended up on the video. Uh, That's okay. So, we're just going to do this. Um, uh, should we time this? I don't know if I want to time this. Alright, right, I'm just gonna I'm gonna start in here because it overlaps that way, so I'm just gonna keep going in this way though, I guess. So I guess we're gonna start sushi, sushi fest 2020. Let's end this year with a bang and possibly having the crafts. Actually this is really good though, so alright, three, two, one, kill me now. Uh-uh. the rice, it's the rice. Oh my gosh. That's what she said. This is a family show, Molly. I said that. I'm a three. I don't know what it was for.
It's like literally all stuck in my throat now. Well, look at this girl. It's like I ate these pancakes the other day. And every time I took a bite, there was a whole chunk stuck in my throat, and I was just like, you've got to get me. The fact that I'm eating cold sushi, I'm bringing cold water. That weighed 115 pounds. I should ask for hot tea. I should have, but I don't like tea. Should I ask for coffee? I, I'm not smart. <laughs> Right here, it was not taken away. He was drying it off for me. Oh, here. Almost done, baby. use hot water the first time I probably would have done my house.
this is basically the final goal. We are rolling. <laughs> Like some of the best sushi I've had, even though I don't like sushi. You know how organic I am. She's organic. That was awesome. Hey. Awesome. That was incredible. Now if we get hot water next time and I'm smart enough, I can do it faster. Now we know. Yeah. And knowing's half the battle. Next time you're killing me. Oh my god. Alright. Ciao. I love you. Anyway guys, 15 pounds of sushi. 15 feet. I took up Tony's whole table and I'm bird beating. Oh. It was delicious. It was awesome. He said I can come back again and do like 20 pounds. Mmm. It was gonna be great. So, steak and main, kick butt sushi. Longest sushi roll ever. Especially in the state of Maryland. Probably ever. Actually, for a challenge, there aren't any sushi rolls that long. I can guarantee that. There's 21 so. seconds in. So, if you ever want some amazing, amazing sushi, steak and made, Northeast Maryland, thank you, Mr. Anthony Kibata, for the best sushi ever. Thank you for a man back there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You rock. And we'll see you next time. All I scatter. Woman versus food. Yeah. <laughs>